Hey there, Vlad here from Model Theme. We are continuing our series of videos helping you get your own fully functional NFT marketplace using WordPress as a base and our NFT theme and the NFT core add-on and the NFT related plugins. If you like this subject matter and our products, don't hesitate to subscribe to be the first to know when a new video is posted. In the last video, we installed and configured the MetaMask Authenticator plugin and the WordPress NFT Creator plugin. With that, our marketplace is fully configured and functional. Now we're going to learn how to mint, list and sell NFTs. So here we are, back on our website, on our Create Digital Asset page. To create an NFT, we must first upload an image. Mind you, images are not the only file types you can use for NFT creation. We have a newly developed plugin that adds more file types to the NFT creator. We will be covering it in a future video. To upload an image, just click on the area and browse for the image file, select it and click open. Alternatively, you can drag and drop the image in the highlighted area. Next, fill in the mandatory asset name field. The rest of the fields are not mandatory, but I do recommend that you fill them. The next fields are necessary to comply with the ERC721 standards and are used to add elements to the properties of the NFT. The NFT's level field is used to express rarity. So for example, if you have a very limited series of your NFTs, you can give it a higher level than the less limited ones. The NFT properties will also help with the SEO of your NFT listing, as well as add to the properties tab of the NFT. Such properties are the shape, color, style, representation, you name it. Okay, so once all the fields are filled, click the Create NFT button. Your wallet connection will pop up and you'll have to authorize the gas fee payment necessary for contract deployment on the blockchain. Next, you'll have to pay for the NFT minting. Once this is completed, you'll get a prompt confirming the success of the minting operation, which will also have a button that will open a new page with the new NFT listing. Now, as you see, the NFT has no price. So, in order to be able to sell it, we have to list it with a price. To do that, simply click on the List NFT button. In my case, I get an error because we don't have permalinks enabled in our WordPress installation. To enable permalinks, head over to the dashboard of the WordPress installation, to the Settings tab, on the Permalinks options, select the Post Name option and click on the Save Changes button. So our listing link will transform from this to NFT slash the NFT's name. Now back to our listing process, this page will appear, which will allow us to list the NFT for sale. To do that, click on the Unlock Selling Functionality button. This will give the marketplace the permissions to transfer the ownership of the NFT and move the funds from the buyer's wallet to the seller's. This is obviously done through the MetaMask wallet. Once we review the permissions and agree with the transaction fee, we click on the Confirm button. A prompt will appear confirming that the marketplace is approved to manage your NFT. Hit the OK button and the page will reload and you'll be able to set the listing price. Once the price is set, click on the List on Marketplace button. This is where we pay the marketplace listing fee. This is the fee that we set when we configured the contract deployment in the NFT Core configuring video. With the marketplace fee, we'll have to pay the gas fee for the contract modification in the blockchain. Once we click on the confirm button, we'll get the pop-up confirming that the NFT is listed in the marketplace and after we click the OK button, the page will reload showing us that the NFT is indeed loaded successfully in the marketplace. We also get a button helping us get to the listed NFT easier. If we click it, we see the NFT with the price we set in the previous page and the Purchase Now button, showing that it can be purchased. So let's just do that, purchase it. Click on the button, the MetaMask widget will open, we confirm the payment of the price plus the gas fee, 
and the prompt confirming our purchase appears. Hit OK and the page reloads. The NFT is now yours and the purchase button disappeared, so it cannot be bought anymore. We can, however, relist the NFT at the same or a different price. Click on the resale button, the MetaMask will pop up again with the listing fee and the gas fee. A few seconds later, we get the prompt confirming the reselling. The page reloads and we get the button linking us to the relisted NFT. If we want to buy it again, we see in the MetaMask widget the listed price plus the gas fee. We go through with the transaction and see that the NFT is once again unpurchasable and that the MetaMask wallet is missing only the gas fee as we are both the seller as well as the buyer. Now that we have transacted this NFT a couple of times, we can visualize these transactions in a blockchain explorer. To access the Avalanche blockchain explorer, we just do a quick Google search with the following query. Blockchain explorer Avalanche testnet. That's because we use the testnet, so we will use the testnet blockchain explorer, obviously. The first option is what we need, so that's where we click. The page is fairly simple and it has a search field where we can input the address, the transaction hash, the block or the token. We're going to search using the contract address, so we head back to our marketplace in the dashboard, in the left sidebar, under the NFT marketplace core, in the manage contracts tab. We identify the contract in our list and copy the field in the contract address column. Back in the blockchain explorer, we paste the address in the search field and click the search button. We can see in the results all the transaction made and their details. So there you have it. You've learned how to create, list, sell and relist NFTs in your very own NFT marketplace using WordPress and the tools developed by the mighty developers here at Model Theme. I think it's quite obvious by now that we put a lot of thought in our products and we want to help you get the most out of them. So leave a comment with what you'd like to see next and we will do our best to make your wish a reality. Cheers!